DC here. Hi guys and gals. Well, it is Sunday morning, as it usually is when I have this cup of coffee. <laughs> so that Sunday morning coffee vlog. Oh, I remember when I used to call them uh, Sunday morning dog vlogs. And then when we lost Dago, uh, it was a Sunday morning no dog vlog. I'm just looking up there because there's the house in front. And just at the peak of the roof, there's a big crow. There's often a crow that just kind of gets there. I took a picture once of him. It's just kind of like crowning and looking around. I think that is the highest point probably around here because of the terrain. Anyway. Yeah. And uh, this weekend, um, I mean, we don't live in Great Britain, but our... Our television stations, we do have the BBC and so on. And I mean, as uh, some of you know, I'm, I'm binational, so Canadian and, and Swiss. And by by being, I mean, the, the, the Canadian part, I mean, I'm actually quite attached to, uh, to, to the Queen and the monarchy and so on. And you say, what? Uh, yeah, I am, actually. I, I like a lot of the, you might be surprised. But I, I like a lot of the values that the Queen, I am talking about the Queen, um, uh, you know, gives off. She's probably the last, I wouldn't put it that way, she's probably the last in her line, at least for a while, I would say, of uh, the Christian monarchs. But, you know, that might be debatable. I'm not here to debate, and I'm not asking you to debate that either. But uh, over the weekend, I mean, it's the Jubilee the Platinum Jubilee uh, weekend. So we've been following it and there's been like the, the usual trooping of the colors, but it was really, it was big this year, big, big. And uh, yesterday we watched, um, in the evening there was the, uh, there was a big concert and it was good, it was good. I'm not saying that I knew everybody, I'm not even saying I liked every style of music. But there was a, 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 a nice representation, I'd say, of, uh, you know, British society over the last 70 years. Uh, in yesterday's concert, they were careful, I guess, not to touch on you know, war. It was mostly about, basically, it was like the first mega reunion. I mean, you should have seen all the people that were there. Mega reunion since the, the pandemic. And... Uh, I know some of you will say it's not over yet, but I'm just saying it was the first mega reunion since the pandemic. And, and I was just going to say, it, it was followed up the words like, we, we shall see each other again. I think he said something like that. So, you know, it, I liked it. I liked it a lot. I mean, we watched also in the afternoon, um, there was uh, unedited or un, yeah, unedited up to a point but also uh, unseen uh, clips of, uh, of the Queen. And where it was not fun, it was actually a person was discussing with her about, you know, the coronation and stuff like that. And she'd say, like, she'd see the crown, and, like, she'd seen the actual crown that would be put on her head at the coronation, like, for the first time since. Because this is not the crown that she wears. There's a crown for the coronation, but anyway. And it was her, her little comments were sometimes kind of, Amusing, like uh, uh, the the narrator would say to her, uh, "What were your kids doing when you had the coronation?" And she said, "I have no idea. Uh, they were with other children, and they were, you know, basically they were doing their own thing." It was like that. It was like, you know, uh, I, I I could imagine she probably was thinking in her mind, "I had other things at that moment to think about as to where my kids exactly were." Things like that. It was another another age and time but you know the thing is is that for many of us uh, I mean especially those of us who were born in the 50s uh, and so I'm like we've not known any other uh, British monarch put it that way and of course we know we know all the stories and you know I come from Canada but I come I come from Quebec and so you can imagine how much the Queen and everything that is British and monarchy is appreciated by a large part of the population. And so I won't get into the too close to the politics there, but anyway, having said that, 
and people don't usually bother, you know. I, I know that they made a visit not too long ago, and of course it was criticized. And to the, on, on the weekend they said, oh, everybody was happy to see us. And I thought, like, no, no. Actually, part of, part of Canada was not happy to see you, but it's always the same part. Anyway, whatever. Whatever. Having said that, though, we, we really enjoyed it. So Mrs. E.C. and I, we watched the, we watched the, the concert, and we were in bed around midnight, something like that. And because it's a, an hour later here, then, uh, well, it's at the same time, but you know what I mean, the time difference. So it was, it was nice. The day before, I think it was on, was it on fr Friday? Yeah. They had a bit all over in the Commonwealth, what they call the lighting of the beacons. So different uh, lights, it could have been the beacon, you know, like uh, on a coast or something like that for some. And for others, it wasn't. It was like, you know, just a question of lights and it shows and so on. So, yeah, I've been talking about six minutes of what we've been doing up to now. Yeah. <coughs> I think, though, anyway, more important, what was this was bringing me up to, and if you're going to, if you're still with me up to now, is that last, so Friday, we, uh, we got together for the Swiss Father's Day, which is actually today. Today is the Swiss Father's Day. The Swiss Father's Day is the first uh, uh, Sunday uh, of the month of June uh, compared to the American one, or Canadian, British, which is the third. <coughs> so, excuse me. Yeah, so we got together at all the family. I made, I made ribs, wings, potato salad, corn, anyway. And so we had, uh, I was going to say a, a North American, or I was almost going to say a, a Missouri-style barbecue. Yeah. It was good. It was good, and that was that was a nice time together. And I think that is probably one of the things that came that put the whole weekend for me together. Is that basically a big party like that, like they we like we had, or like there was in uh, in Britain. It's kind of like put them together and have them have fun, you know. And I think that's that's a big thing, you know, a part of. Uh, part of life is actually rejoicing and in today's world right now I definitely think we need a lot more rejoicing but yeah but yeah it was good I mean really really enjoyed enjoyed the weekend up to now my vacation there's been a lot of rain and yeah not great weather but it was a good vacation it was a good nevertheless you know rested up and getting ready you know for attacking the workplace again uh, yeah. Is there anything else? Yeah, well, there is in a way. Actually, Mrs. DC is leaving on Thursday. She's going for three weeks in Spain. I'd mentioned in other vlogs. So, it's in the northern part of Spain. So, it's not like, don't imagine it's like part of Spain, you know, where the, uh, on the, uh, it's like the east coast, like near Barcelona, where there's the Mediterranean, where it's very warm. No, they're going like in, uh, uh, Compostela, which is like a, uh, what is that? That's the Galicia? Yeah, it's Galicia. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but anyway, so that's near Compostela. And uh, so that, that'll that be nice, but like I said, it's it's like kind of weather that's close to here, because it's kind of northern Spain. Although northern Spain is certainly a lot more south than this part of the world is. Anyway, so she's gone for, for three weeks, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna see what I'm gonna do. <laughs> yeah. No, actually, I think there's no problem. We planted some plants. We did a bit of gardening. I just there's work there, and I am planning on having once, if possible. I mean, promising this to two guys at work for about two years now. Uh, have a barbecue together, and I thought, well, why not do it now? You know, uh, that way uh, it'll, you know one of the Fridays or something like that. But we'll see how it works out. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah, I think so. I'm coming up to 10 minutes. I should stop. I really should. I'm doing this on the iPad and out on the deck. So I hope you've all ha had a good weekend up to now. And I'm wishing you all a good Sunday. And I'm going to keep on drinking my coffee. And I'm going to go... I think I'll go watch... Uh, uh, listen to Sing for Joy. Let my choir... Uh, radio show. Okay. Take care, everybody. Have a happy Sunday. DC signing off.